And now, your Eclipse Minute. I'm Storm Team Meteorologist Kate Thornton. The total solar eclipse on April 8th is a once-in-a-lifetime event, so I'm sure you're going to want to document it with maybe your phone or an actual camera. But can you do so safely? Yes, if you take the proper precautions. If you're trying to get a picture of it with your cell phone, you're going to need a little help. NASA has a few tips on their website, and they recommend having a zoom lens that can attach right onto your phone. They're usually about 20 bucks online. Otherwise, it'll just look too pixelated. And you don't want to ruin your phone by pointing it right at the sun. So put a pair of solar glasses right over your phone's camera to see the eclipse in action. Want to use an actual camera? Camera, a solar lens is a good idea too. But the best recommendation from NASA? Just enjoy it with your own two eyes, with a pair of eclipse glasses, of course, and take a selfie or pictures of others around you to capture the moment.